Scrapper Sam here. Welcome to my channel and welcome to the Scrapper Sam Show. Having a lot of technical difficulties yesterday. <clears throat> my video was delayed. Uh, instead of coming out on prime time Sunday, <laughs> it's going to be coming out on not so prime time Monday. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> oh gosh, there's a car coming. Busy day here at the scrapyard. Uh, gonna try and get unloaded here pretty quick. Ah. Got the straps off, got the uh, uh, tailgate down, the little loading ramp down, so we should be uh, able to get everything off pretty quick. Ah. Sorry, usually I get these straps off before I start my video, but this one's kind of stuck up here. Painted aluminum, I guess, yeah. Yep. And this one, steel. Yep. <clears throat> Try to get some of this uh, Christmas tree lighting off here. We can get a better price for that. I'm not sure how much more, uh, it'll be, but it'll definitely be more than uh, the seven cents we'd get in shred. We'll find out. It's not terribly busy now. Uh, so we'll just give it a shot. quite a bit of wire off this one. This one's a snowman. Unfortunately, Frosty's days are done. Ah. Okay, that wasn't too hard. Some of these I know are gonna be next to impossible to uh, strip like that, but this one was pretty easy. And there's still quite a bit of scrap there. Some of the stuff I thought I was going to be able to. Sorry. Can you answer a question for me? Sure. I've never been here before. Okay. I just pulled up on that scale, but they just said go on. Yes. So how do you get paid for this stuff? So what happens is uh, you'll unload mm -hmm. and you'll drive uh, to the left of the scale and get back on the scale this way, uh -huh. 
don't go on it this way because that's do not enter. Right. And then uh, they'll weigh you a second time and they'll pay you for the difference. I got you. Okay. Thank you. Sure, no problem. It'd probably be about ten dollars, maybe maybe a little more. That wasn't too bad. Oh, this was an LED one too. Well, that didn't last long. I'm all alone in the scrapyard again. He, uh, the guy that I was talking to a second ago dropped off a really nice washing machine. He could have just called somebody to pick that up for him. Most of people like me would pick it up for free. Oh, someone's got, someone lost their little headlight. It's a Whirlpool high-end type of a machine. I'm gonna just chop this off for a second. Ah, okay. So which one of these? Uh, I think it was the other one that was the better one. Which is good because I'd hate to take this off and have to uh, reload it. Oh gosh, these are heavy. Ah, okay. Huh, I think this is aluminum. This handle. 
Yeah, that's aluminum. Ha ha ha. Well, we'll see if we can get that unscrewed. It looks like it's pretty rusty. Does that help? Maybe a couple more there. Huh. Oh, I might have to cut off that piece of uh, aluminum. I need to change the blade on here to my cutoff wheel. But Okay, so we will have some aluminum to uh, turn in today, and maybe some copper too. These are aluminum, I think, but they've got so much junk on them, it'll take me forever to clean them up. This is a nice reindeer. Maybe you should go back home with me. <coughs> I think I've got room in the yard for one more reindeer. Well, this one will be easy enough to get untangled.
get my scissors out or maybe out of those on the other side huh that's okay I got these not quite as efficient but huh should have cut that little tie a bit of wire
Oh, this one had... Oh, I see. I didn't realize there were <clears throat> two trees in here something like that. Two stars at least. I didn't, I didn't test this one, my wife did, and she said only part of it was working, so that's why I'm scrapping it, but, huh. These incandescent uh, kind just are a pain to try and fix too. Oh, this is taking a lot longer than I expected. Goodness. I want to try and keep this intact too because it's, it's a, uh, this part I might be able to reuse. And this is like fishing line. is kind of a standalone item. Okay. Well, I'm keeping more stuff than I expected. Ah, let's get these reindeer over here. I may not even be able to cash in these uh, lights today, but that's okay. I've got uh, a stack of them at home that I'm working on anyway. Come on, let go. That looks brand new. See, I've got more lights over here. Well, I got stuff going on today, so. Just getting this 
unloaded somewhat is uh, going to be a big help. Christmas tree light stuff here still. and 80 cents for all of our shred uh, as usual on Monday the small scales are are just lined up they've got a waiting line so I got stuff going on today I'm gonna go ahead and bypass the uh, small scale but uh, I do have all those uh, Christmas lights that I'm gonna combine with some other Christmas lights and take in at the same time and then um, I've got the uh, the fold downstairs for my attic and the laser printer and all the laser printer cartridges gosh i really hope that thing works i'm going to try that i don't have time to try it today but i'm going to uh haul it inside and uh and see if it works uh later this week so anyway uh thanks everybody for coming along i know this is kind of an unusual deal where the uh rest of the video is is already published and then i'm out here doing the unloading but uh, some people wanted to hear the crashing and banging at the scrapyard, and they also like to see the the big claw and some of the other equipment there. So uh, this is for them, and no music track, just uh, the natural sound of the scrapyard. Thank you, everyone, for uh, subscribing. I really appreciate that. Uh, I I'm over 800 subscribers now, so just 200 more, I'll be so happy. Thank you all for watching and liking my videos. I'll see you on the next one. Scrapper Sam.